Okay, this is a short video uh, to talk about the World Religions IA. Um, a couple things about that. Uh, I record this today at uh, on March 2nd. Uh, theoretically, your Section D was due last night, but I'm okay uh, if it's done sometime in the next week. I know we've got a lot of stuff going on. The final IA uh, was originally due uh, next Friday, March 12th. I'm going to move that. Sorry. I'm going to move that to the following Monday, the 15th. But that's a pretty hard date. Uh, I've got to have time to grade these uh, and get them submitted to IB. So uh, 15th, hard date. Uh, and I'm going to give you feedback on both your Section C's and your Section D's with which to revise your IA. I, I, I'm sorry, I'm kind of behind on the Section C's, uh, but I will get that done. Uh, this week. Uh, I'm just overwhelmed like you guys. I also want to, uh, I have a new document that I want to show you uh, in the assessment folder, module rather, here at the bottom. There's something called World Religions IA Decoder Ring. Uh, and I would have shown you this before we started, but uh, I had not finished it. I finished it because I think there's some confusion over what part goes where, and I've tried to eliminate that. So, um, section uh, uh, a uh, is really two parts. It's called the rationale and preliminary research. So for the rationale part, you just want to say, why is this a thing? Uh, and you want to include your research question. Will you have references in this section? No. You're going to use your facts only information, which was from tertiary sources. I wanted to know what they are, but you're not going to put those uh, in your, your work cited for, for this paper. You're, you're just common knowledge stuff. Um, the second part of A uh, is your preliminary research, uh, and these are these two things are saying the same thing, just different ways. You want to kind of uh, talk about the vocabulary, the basic facts. Uh, you may have some references uh, in addition to some facts only information. By the way, I, I uh, unlike the history IA, there's no recommended breakdown of your uh, your total word count is supposed to be 1,500 to 1,800 words for IA. There is no recommended breakdown, but I have looked at some good IAs and to give you a little bit of guidance. Um, 400 to 500 words-ish for Section A seems about right. Section B is the plan for study. You're going to talk about how you're going to answer the question, describe your sources. You're going to, in other words, state and focus the research question. Is that repetitive somewhat? Yes. This IA is somewhat repetitive and um, uh, world religions is being revised right now and this is one of the things they're going to fix. You're going to take Focus the question and tell how you're going to answer it. This is short. Uh, this is 100 to 150 words. Um, now, C, the summary of significant findings. So you're, you're looking for answers to a question, some stuff. So identify the findings. Um, explain the relationship between the findings and the research question. Discuss the rationale and plan for study in relation to significant findings. So present the findings and relate that back to the Research question, the rationale and plan. Uh, I'm 500 to 600 words. And then the final portion is critical reflection and evaluation. Critically reflect on the findings in relation to the research question. Well, that sounds kind of like what you're doing up here. Yes, it's somewhat, it's subtly different, so uh, it is a little repetitive. But um, uh, demonstrate how the study deepens understanding of religious experience and or belief. That's the whole point of a religion's IA. What, I have a question about this aspect of religious experience and or belief. So how, how, um, how does this deepen that? Because that's the whole point. Uh, identify misconceptions and inconsistencies and un uh, understand the degree of success uh, in answering your question and maybe indicate just possible future research. Okay, so that's the paper. Uh, I do the, the, Another criterion is on the formatting. I want to point out if you, the recommended length is 1,500 to 1,800 words. If you exceed, if your paper exceeds 1,800 words by even one, you will lose all the points for this section, which is three points. It's out of 30. That's 10%. So please do not exceed 1,800 words. Um, let me know if you have any questions, and I look forward to reading them.